All right, guys, this is a video of all my tackle that I own. It's all salt water gear, really. I mean, a little bit of fresh. Then my tackle box. So, all right, let's get into it. Tackle box, I just have a regular Plano. I don't know, like, what model or whatever it is. Here, just, yeah. <laughs> Plano, Plano tackle box. Side pouch, middle pouch, side pouch. Then the middle where you store your actual plastic boxes. So, I normally, in the middle, I normally store this box this box and I just have this toothproof, toothproof it's called toothproof whatever um, this is stainless steel leader wire I have 58 pound it's perfect for like mackerel king mackerel sharks whatever cuda so that's perfect for that and then I also have this knife nothing nothing special it's a Billy Bay just I think it's like three dollars all right then I have sunscreen and I also have, I live in Florida, so I have a little Florida law stick, so it tells you the regulations, and it's a measuring tape when you pour it out. That's cool. Goes up to 36 inches. So that's that. So, got that. And I have these scissors, I'm not supposed to be in there. So that's all you have in there. And then, all right, let's go to my hard plastics now. So, cure tube, simple. So here's a fresh water, watermelon seed with the weedless hook I got at rig. That's my garage. <laughs> it's making a weird noise. Then I have this, it's like half octopus, half squid. It's a savage gear lure. 100 gram savage gear lure. This is the octopus and this is the squid. Don't really even know what this is for. <laughs> I found that. And right here, I got a snook tube. And right here, my favorite lure is a user. I lost my favorite one with a nice snook that took me around a piling, but here is. This is Usuri, like crystal mineral or whatever. I don't know what this is, this is old, something old. I have this right here. We just have Usuri, it's like, I think it's a shad color or something. And that's this, I'll show you a good look at it. And that's this, it's like, it's like, it's, this, it's like a representation of like a, a shad or like some sort of bait fish. And right here I got rattle, my rattle traps. I got a mini rattle trap, a bigger rattle trap, and that feather. I don't know that much about rattle traps. I just know more about the gear that I use more often. So I got those rattle traps. I don't really use those that much. I've had those for a long time. And then here I have a rebel popper. It's a fresh water lure, but you can use them in salt water. And I have a top dog, Miradine top dog. I mean, not Miradine, Miradine top dog. These are really good for trout, and snook, and redfish. And I have a heat and spook. That's a super spook junior. In the bone pattern, I'm pretty sure. Then another Miradine top dog. No, I keep saying Miradine. Miradine top dog. <laughs> Sorry. All right, in this next compartment, I have a voodoo mullet. And a chartreuse voodoo mullet. Then I also have a gotcha clip, the mini one. So that's what I have in there. And these are all Savage Gear shrimp, really cool, really nice design. They're super realistic, good coloration. And they have the two antennas, and then if you listen, I'm not sure if you can hear that, but they have a rattle in there. Redfish, trout, and snook all over that. So that's that. So in here, spool tech, three inch. Bait Buster. This is a deep diving. Looks like a greenback. And here's the extra spool tech tail. And here, suspending twitch bait. Mirror lure suspending twitch bait. I have a mirror lure, a mirror lure um, sinking twitch bait. Then I have a mirror lure, mirror done, the regular size. And then I have some random other lure that my friend gave me when we were fishing. So that's there. And then the next compartment, I have an old popper. I don't know what brand that is. So then I have a wake bait, a little wake bait. Then I have one more. This is a super spook, not the junior. This is the five inch, I believe. Yeah, it's five inches. Here's a super spook, heating super spook. Three sets of troubles. 
So that's all I got for my hard plastic press. And now let's go to my hooks, weights, leader lines, stuff like that. So to start off, we'll go over my hooks. These are just bigger, what I use for snapper, grouper fishing, sport circle hooks. These are size five of them. Size two, I'm not gonna say the size anymore, I'm just gonna show you. A little bit bigger. Perfect for like redfish. Barrel swivels. Some more bigger hooks. Then here's just like a Kudo mackerel rig I made. These are anything to keep. Put that in here. Perfect. Yeah. In here, scissors. Use them as pliers with wire cutters. Seaguar 10 pound, 100% fluorocarbon. Best leader, Seaguar. Don't have Vanish. This is 30 pound, all right, but trust me, this, this is 40 pound. I have just put on a different spool, so. This is 40 pound, this is triple fish, 100% fluorocarbon. Saltwater leader line, in a different package. Then this, this says 20 pound, but this is actually 25 pound. This is vanished though. So this is 25 pound vanish on this bullet it says 20. I'm pretty sure it's called like Captain Joe or something. Captain Jack or whatever. Um, popping cork. Um, for trolling like Ballyhoo or whatever behind your boat. Bunch of DOA shrimp. Just the regular three inch. And here it's a, like a crack, crab rig for like pompano and permit and stuff. I don't really use that, but what else? I think, yeah, that's everything I got in here. So that's this shrimp and all DOA shrimp in this one crab. Here are two bobbers, weighted bobbers. There's, you know, two regular clip on weighted bobbers. So that's right there. And here I just have the regular, like cheap Walmart jig hats. They work perfectly fine. I got one nice DOA heavy jig head. Same in here, just yellow. Weedless hooks for bass fishing. These are the bigger hooks that I had. And these are all circle hooks. Just random sizes, approximately about this big. Circle hooks about that big. Then in here, yeah, those are the circle hooks. Right here, those are the bigger ones. Those are the ones that I was talking about, this big. And then in here, I have a little for catching like bait fish, just tiny little hooks. Here, um, these are called, these are, I forgot what they're called. They're for panfish and bass, beetle spins. Here are pompano jigs. Here are banana swirls or whatever they are. And here, these are little top water, like poppers that just pull down. They're really light. So that's everything in there, guys. And now I'll show you my soft plastics that I rig with the jig heads. All right, so if I spin over here, if I open up this front pouch, if I can get it open somehow from here. Just put my foot in it. <laughs> so here, these are all my soft plastics. So here, I'll just throw them down with this. QA fluids, friend gave me this color, the white one. I have the black. And you can rig them with a weighted weedless jig head or just a regular jig head. That's it. Black Silver Rust, I think it says. That's these, these are flukes. These are the DOA cows with your cats. And this is a Kytec that my friend also gave me. I trade a bunch of lures. So. And here's another DOA cow with a DOA cow jig head. Swimming wall hook chartreuse, four inch gulp. The root beer chartreuse, DOA cows. And um, this is molting, but these aren't the actual molting ones. These are, um, I forget what they're called, but these are not the molting, it's a different color. These are a lot of three inch saltwater gulp shrimp. These are really small lures, but really small um, three inch Kytex. Sight flash. And last but not least, well not last, almost last. <laughs> so these are just a bunch of Assorted DOA cows. 
bunch of random ones that I have found, traded, or that I just have left over. And these are mirror lures right here. But these are just the leftovers, the, all the ones that I had about one or two left of. Then here, friend were just throwing these away, so I took them because they're really like, small. But I'm sure you can catch pinfish and bait on these and stuff. Rig twirl tails. It's one sixteen ounce seven pack. I got one more in here. One thirty two ounce seven pack. So guys, that's everything. All my tackle that I have, guys. So please give it a like, um, thumbs up. Yeah, same thing. Just please give it a like, comment, and subscribe, guys. I'll see you on the next video. Peace out.